Hello everyone, this is Kinjal Parmar. In a previous session, we we'll discuss about number systems, types of number system, and uh, how uh, one number system can be converted into another number system. In which uh, we discussed about decimal to any base conversion and any base to decimal conversion. Now let's discuss about uh, another number conversions. So first is how binary numbers can be converted in a octal number. So to convert binary number into octal number, we have to make a group of three bits from least significant bits to most significant bit. Make a group of three bits. Now why group of three bits? Because binary has a base of two and octal has a base of eight. Now eight is equals to two raised to three. Right. So remember, we have to make a group of three bits to convert any binary number into octal. Let's take one example. Now, for example, we have a, this binary pattern 10101.11 binary numbers. Now we want to convert this binary number into octal number. So now uh, uh, we have to write to three bits equivalent to one octal number now how we can write this so here one table shown that for three bit of binary there is a one octal number so we have a zero 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 binary for a octal zero we have a zero zero one octal one then zero one zero octal two now how these all numbers are written so basically binary has a three bits that is zero 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 or say zero zero one each bit has a weight here uh, from rightmost bit the rightmost bit has a weight of 1 then next bit has a weight of 2 and next bit has a weight of 4 so we have a 4 2 1 as a weight now whenever we want to write any octal number we can make a sum of this weight and write octal number now, for example, we have a octal number 3. So, what will be the pattern of binary? So, we have a 4, 2, 1. So, as we know, 2 plus 1 is equals to 3. So, we write 1 and 1 over here. Uh, this 1. This 1 belongs to. 1 and this belongs to weight of 2. So 2 plus 1 is equals to 3. So this is how we can write binary number. Next we have a uh, octal number 4. So how we can write this octal number 4? So this beat has a this beat has a weight of 1. This beat has a weight of 2. This beat has a weight of 4. So we just put 1 over here and we write octal number 4. Now if we want to write octal number 5 then what will be the binary pattern? So as we know 1, 2, 4. So 4 plus 1 we have a 5. So this is how we can write binary equivalent of a octal number. So let's take example uh, how we can do this. So we have a, this binary digits. Now this binary digit is written in a group of 3. So from point side we make a group uh, starting from this. Starting from this we have to make a group like this. So we have a 1 0 1 so equivalent to 101 we have a binary octal equivalent 5 then for 0 1 0 we have a 2 then here only 1 is left so we can add a 0 0 in a most significant bit and simply we write 1 1 uh, we can uh, add zeros to convert this one group into group of 3 bits so we can write uh, like this and after point we make a group like this and this equivalent to 7 so we can convert this octal digit into binary digit such that we have an answer 125.7 again 
uh, how we can convert binary into octal so we have a binary pattern make a group of 3 bits if we have a fractional number we can start uh, making group from point side so from this we can start making group then we have we successively make a group of 3 bits and write uh, uh, octal equivalent for each 3 bits of a binary and eventually we get the answer. Next, how we can convert octal to binary? So it is simple as uh, we have a 3 bit binary is equivalent to 1 octal number then 1 octal number is equivalent to 3 bit of binary, 1 octal number is equivalent to 3 bit of binary. For example, we have a 673.124 in an octal number. We can convert this number into binary by writing 3 bits of its binary equivalent. For example, 4 has a binary equivalent 100, 2 has equivalent 010, 1 is 001, 3 is 011, 7 is equivalent to 111 and 6 is equivalent to 110. Simply write this and make an answer in a binary pattern. So to convert octal number into binary, this is how we can convert numbers into octal to binary. Now next, binary to hexadecimal number. So how we can convert binary number into hexadecimal number? So it is simple, we have to make a group of 4 bits from least significant bits to convert any binary number into hexadecimal number. Now why group of 4? Because binary has a base of 2, hexadecimal has a base of 16. So 16 is equivalent to 2 raised to 4. So we have to make a group of 4 bits to convert binary number into hexadecimal number. So let's take example how we can write binary to hexadecimal number. So we have a binary pattern over here and we have to write hexadecimal number. So first divide this pattern into group of 4 bits. So here we make a group of 4 bits and how this is how we can write. Now we have to make a group of 4 bits and for individual 4 bits write one hex digit. Now uh, how we can write one hex digit? So here we have a group of four bits. So this is how first bit has a weight of one. This uh, number has a weight of one. Then this number has a weight of two. This number has a weight of four. And this number has a weight of eight. So 8421 to convert any binary number into hexadecimal number we have to remember this this 4 bit of binary has a weight of 8421 so this 1011 pattern rep what is this 1011 pattern represent here we have a 1 2 so 2 plus 1 3 3 plus 8 that is 11 and to represent 11 we write B because 10 is equals to A and 11 is equivalent to B. So this is how we can write uh, 4 bit of binary is equivalent to 1 hex number. Again we have a here this pattern so it has a weight of 1, this has a weight of 2, this has a weight of 4 and this has a weight of 8. So 4 plus 2 we have a hex number 6. Again we have a 1 2, 4 and 8 and 8 plus 4 is equivalent to 12 and 12 is equivalent to hex number C. So this is how we can write 4 bit of binary is equivalent to its hex number and this is how we got the answer which is 2C6D point F3. Remember here we make a group of 4 from point this pattern and from this manner okay so this is how we can make a group from uh, for a binary bits and then write four bit of binary is equivalent to one hex number here is a table to show four bit of binary is equivalent to one hex number we have a total 15 numbers and uh, 15 binary number is represented here uh, from 00 to 111 and its equivalent hex number is represented.
Now next conversion is hexadecimal to binary conversion. So it is very simple. If a four bit of binary is equivalent to one hex number, then one hex number is equivalent to four bit of binary. So for one individual hex bit, we have to write its binary equivalent. So let's take example. Here we have a hex number D five A nine point C E. So how we can write? Simply just put four bit of binary for each hex digit. Here we have a nine. So for nine we can write one zero zero one. Again we have a binary uh, pattern with uh, like one, two, four, and eight. And eight plus one is equals to nine. Similarly, eight plus two is equals to ten. One five that means four plus one is equals to five, and D that means eight plus four plus one that is equivalent to thirteen. So this is how we can write uh, one hex number equivalent to four bits of binary. Next is the octal to hexadecimal conversion. Now octal to hexadecimal conversion is quite difficult. So to convert any octal number to hexadecimal conversion, we have to do uh, two steps. First, we have to convert octal number to its binary equivalent, and then convert this binary equivalent to its hexadecimal number by making group of four bits. Remember, we cannot directly convert octal number into hexadecimal number. So we have to convert octal number into other number system, then from other number system to hexadecimal number system. And as octal to binary conversion and binary to hex conversion is quite easy, so here we convert octal number into binary equivalent, and then binary number is converted into hexadecimal number. To convert octal number to its binary, we use three bit, and to convert binary to hex, we use four bit. Now let's take example. Here we have a six seven three point one two four octal number. This octal number can be converted into uh, hexadecimal number by converting first into binary equivalent. So first we write binary equivalent equivalent for this. So we have a this binary equivalent for Each octal number in a three bit of binary equivalent, so we get three three. That means this has a weight of one four two one. So two plus one three. So here we get one one seven. That means four plus two plus one. So all our bits are one. So we have a one one one. Then six. That means four plus two. That means six. So four plus two and four plus two is equals to six. So this is how we can write. One octal number is equivalent to three bit of binary. Now this binary number is converted into hexadecimal number by making group of four bits. So next task is to convert this three bits into group of four bits and then write one hex number for each. So this is how we make a group of four bits and then for each group we have a one hex number. So this is how we can convert octal To hexadecimal number. First, uh, write octal number to its three-bit binary equivalent. Then, three bits binary equivalent patterns are converted into group of four bits. And for each group of four bits, we can write one hex number. And we write this uh, number into octal to hex number. Now next we have to convert hexadecimal to octal. So again, hex to octal direct conversion is not possible. So we have to convert hexadecimal number into binary equivalent, then binary to octal. Again, hex to binary and binary to octal is quite easy. So we use uh, this conversion method here. So Have one hex number is represented by four bit of binary equivalent. Then this four bit of binary equivalent is uh, divided in a three groups, and the, for each group we write one octal number. Here we have an example D five A nine point C E. This hex number is converted into octal number by making first. For it is by writing four bit of binary equivalent. So here we have a four bit of binary equivalent for each.
hex number now this each hex number is divided into three bits so uh these all uh, three groups have a one equivalent octal number so here uh, this octal number representation and uh, by writing this we can convert this uh, hex number into octal conversion first we have to write uh, hex number is uh, in equivalent to four bits of binary then four bit of binary is converted into three gro three uh, group of three bits then group of three bits is written to equivalent of octal number so here we write uh, one octal number for each three bit group so this is how we can convert hexadecimal to octal number so this is how we can convert numbers into other number system in today's uh, session we discuss about binary to octal conversion binary to octal conversion is done by writing three bit of binary into its equivalent one of the number then binary to hex conversion binary to hex conversion is done by making uh four by uh, four bit of binary to its equivalent one hex number then we uh, we discussed about uh, octal to hexa and hexa to octal conversion and again as octal to hex and hex to octal direct conversion is not possible so we have to use binary conversion method to uh, do this conversion so this is how we can convert any number systems to another number system thank you